Hey everybody, welcome to REM TV and welcome back to a Madden Connected franchise. This is episode 4 and here we are for week 4 against the Jaguars. We are 3-0 if you guys have been keeping up, but the Jags are 1-2. So we're going to try to keep our winning ways and try to stay undefeated. Oh boy, it's a big run. So Armstead, that's 18 yards for the Jags. I hope their running game is not going to be an issue. Another first down for them. That's a 14-yard pass for Nick Foles. There you go. It's a big catch by Sutton. And that's a first down. There you go. Finally some positive yardage for Philip Lindsay. That's a first down. In the end zone. And it's caught for the touchdown. That is a catch by Cortland Sutton. What a throw. Let's go, man. That might be Drew Locke's best throw. At least long, uh, long distance. And that is a catch in four arms. <laughs> On second down, a run with Lindsey. And this may be a boy. Again, be stopped right at the line of scrimmage. Looking collarbone. Oh my Call goodness. Really chug on it. What do we need to do to pick up a first down and change our momentum? Oh no, look at his leg. That was disgusting. Lindsey and the Broncos. First month of the season, those numbers pretty solid. Does he continue that? What a catch! And he's going! Oh, he shook him! That's another first down for Drew Lock and the Broncos. 115 yards passing in the first quarter. Another long pass, and it's caught! That is another touchdown to Colin Sutton! Beating the defender from the straight from the get-go for a pass in the end zone. He put you on offense. Be aware, ball may come your way. There's locked to throw. No, wide open. Drew, come on. Down is looming. A pickup of two on first down and just one yard there. Stopped. Good stop by the defense. They're moving pretty forward. That is forcing a fourth down and a field goal. Well, he's made a little deep, 40 plus yards. It's up. And it's good. Good kick. 17 to 3. Been good. They've utilized him well, but they're losing here in the second quarter. What might Give me that. And that throw it's going to be a pick six for Chris Harris. Back to back weeks with a pick six. This defense has been tremendous for the Broncos. And that makes things 23 to 3. Talk about being any passing offense nowadays. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, what a catch. That's a sack. That is a tattoo. The Jaguars now. This will approach NFL record territory. It's a 60. It's up, and it's. And I don't think this has no good. So now they've got a chance to get one more drive in before halftime. A run there on first down and a pretty good one of five yards. So make it second and five. Officials so kind of right, here we go nowadays, with that, that penalty. Easy. Yeah, you're right. I'm gonna go for this field goal. Hands, having to wonder whether it's a five it's yard up. Or 15 yard and it's now good it's right down the middle. 45 yard field goal. 27 3 as we head into halftime. That's a sack. That is a sack by Atachu. That's the second sack of the game. Beat your chest, big man. That is a big sack. 
He'll drop to throw. Oh, that's a touchdown. Chris Harris Jr. just a second late, not even a second. Good pass. Oh, they're going for two. Let's see. Nope. <laughs> Von Miller. Met him right there. For the stop. Wow, down the middle. Again, another hole. No! That's a touchdown. Oh, it's picked off. Throw is that. Jeez, man, our secondary is not doing anything. <sighs> All right, another long field goal for the Broncos. I think we should be okay. What's up? And it's good. Up the middle, 30 to 16. Five and a half minutes. Give me that ball. This is going to be another pick six. This time, Will Parks. Keep running, baby. That's it. That is another pick six. Back to back weeks where we have two pick sixes. Apparently, our defense has been amazing. That is the final whistle. We beat the Jags. We win by 21, I believe. And we had two pick sixes that changed the game. Oh, boy. I didn't expect to win this much, to be honest. But obviously, not the case. We had two pick sixes, we had two pa passing touchdowns by lock. We did get picked off once. But I'll take it, but they destroyed us in the passing, man, and rushing. I just, <laughs> statistically, I don't know how he won. Besides turnovers, Drew Locke, 171 yards, two touchdowns, and a pick. Um, player stats, let's check out the Broncos. Drew Locke, 171 yards, two touchdowns, one interception. Rushing. It was a tough day. Um, Next week for a match. 133 Carolina yards, five, re five receptions, Hyman 10 yards, and, for Charles Davis, and then Tim Patrick, the second leading Gunn, receiver with 17 yards. Uh, let's see. Excuse me. And then we got uh, Alexander Johnson with 13 tackles, Will Parks with 12 tackles. It's a crazy day. Defensively, again, two interceptions leading to two touchdowns. And, uh, I guess there's a silver lining on this, even though we did have, give up that many yards. We had two pick sixes that separated us and the Jags. Uh, I guess the best thing I can really say. Hopefully, I can level up uh, Drew Lock because I can't. You know, he's he's okay. He's okay. Uh, but then Chris Harris Jr. again, the player. Of, no, that was last week. I'm sorry. Um, Bennett, 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 okay. Alright, cool. That's my legacy. Going to injury. Probably Philip Lindsay, right? No, no, it's like Deontay Spencer. He did break his collarbone. Fine. That's expected. We saw it. Um, we advance into the next week. Let's see what we got. Let's see the weekly awards. We got Will Parks, 12 tackles, one interception, one touchdown. Our defense is winning players of the weeks, man. It's crazy. Will Sutton. Yikes. That's a lot. <laughs> That's a pretty big goal. We can try to slow him down, but I don't know if we can stop him. I don't think so. But we'll see what we can do. Upgrade players. How did Joe Flacco get an upgrade point, but not 
I'm on 10, 10, 10. Yeah. But not, but not the guy that's actually playing. Really? Come on, man. Unbelievable. I'm trying to improve it, uh, Julak, but it's not happening. Oh, my goodness. I'm gonna take a look at what's his name. Um, Julak, because he. I thought he'd at least have one upgrade by now. Oh my gosh, man. Ugh. So bad. I don't understand. Anyway, that wraps it up for my Denver Broncos franchise. Hope you guys liked it. Don't forget to click that like button. Leave any comments below. If you haven't already, subscribe and click that notification bell. And I'll see you guys later. Take it easy and peace.